to 192 Washington Avenue in Clinton Hill, Brooklyn. Come on in. So you come in through this gracious foyer entryway, but the parlor level, it's accentuated by 10 foot 10 ceilings. The volume of space here is really a grand reception. You have this beautiful formal dining area when you first come in. If you pan up to some of the detail on the crown molding, this house is over 120 years old. You can also see the strategically placed recessed lighting throughout not to damage any of the molding and really keep intact the integrity of the home. As we come through here, some other features are these original pocket doors that have, that have been completely restored. You can see the tracks move very smoothly. And as we come in through this transition space, you have this beautiful double-sided bar here. This is black marble quartz, and you have a Summit wine refrigerator here, but just a great entertaining space overall. It's great for entertaining, it's great for comfortable living, and it's great for a family as well. As we come into the main space here, you can see some of the details. This is a rarity in the sense that it's a working wood burning fireplace here. And you see it's anchored by this beautiful pier mirror. This is over 10 feet high and it's been gorgeously restored. You can see some of the details in that mirror. I mean, it's just a beautiful home. As you look out to the backyard as well, this is your own private backyard here. So the home is four bedrooms, three and a half baths, and I'm excited to give you this tour. So we'll take you to the garden level next. Hi, welcome to the garden level. So the garden level can be accessed either through the staircase from the parlor level or the door behind you, which is your own separate masonette entrance off the ground floor. All the doors and hardware have been renovated by this owner. Um, you have these beautiful oak hardwood floors throughout. It's a very clean, minimal space and it's perfectly thought out in terms of living. So you have a bright window in the front, but you have this beautiful waterfall quartz countertop, which is book match, the backsplash and the waterfall, but you have this wolf hood that also vents to the exterior here with the five burner gas range. But all these little details have been carefully thought out. You have USB outlets in addition to electrical outlets here. This is your Kohler sink with an sinkerator. You have a double wolf oven here, but this is all seamlessly integrated as well. Really gorgeous. And you can see to the side here, you have informal dining, which leads out to your private backyard as well. This window here was also put in, in addition to the glass door here. Um, on this level, you do have your powder room here, which is conveniently placed, and then you have three full bathrooms upstairs as well. If we swing around here, this is a beautiful pantry area, as you can see, very organized, and this is a full-size laundry station with folding table here, hangers. It's a really well thought out space. Now, why don't I take you out to the backyard? So coming into the backyard here, um, you can see the flooring here, it's bluestone. This has been repurposed actually from the front of the house. I love the aspect of it, but it gives a nice coloration to it. There's new fence lines here. There's a new concrete retaining wall in the rear. You have water here as well. And in this corner, there is potential to easily hook up a gas line. So if anyone wanted a dedicated gas grill, that's very easy to set up here. Here in the rear, you have uh, your own little patch of grass here. So this is dining al fresco. The backyard here is pitched in the rear, so you have the drainage as well. Super well thought out. This home is in move-in condition. Thank you, and on to the next level.
Hi, we're going to pass the baton and I'm going to take you to the top two floors where the bedrooms and bathrooms are. We have four full bedrooms and three full baths. Come on up. You'll see they painstakingly restored this banister. They even powder coated it, which is a really beautiful, sleek finish. And then I'll take you to the master first. The master bedroom faces east. What I love about this brownstone is you have tree views everywhere. You have a massive open space here, king size bed. Again, I just have to bring your attention back to the painstaking details and restoration that they did, as well as having these high hat lights throughout the entire space. You have another beautiful decorative fireplace. And then, as a really thoughtful detail, they did a barn door style entrance into their master bath, and they echoed that theme as you come with me. They did this beautiful roller shower. You have the rainfall shower as well as the standard shower head, a little niche here for you. The entire apartment is wrapped in beautiful Italian stone. I'm slightly obsessed with this detailed texture. You have tons of storage. And then this mirror is my dream mirror. Um, it has a defogger, it dims, it's all touchscreen, it's dreamy. And then for the master closet, you easily have storage for tons of clothing, sh shoes, and you have dresser drawers as well as hanging. Also the cushy carpet's nice on your feet. Now let's go to the other bedroom and bathroom. Again, you have blinds that can go from the top down or down up, depending on what kind of view you'd like. And what I like about these hallways and these open staircases is you can really feel a nice width of space. Here, we have another bedroom. I'm kind of obsessed with how adorable this is. It's quiet because you're now facing west, the interior of the building. You have nice greenery. Again. You've also got the Mitsubishi systems, which I'm remembering here as I look at it, so that you have AC controls in multiple rooms and floors. You have a really fantastic closet here. They live like that. And then you have a really beautiful, the high ceilings in this bathroom make it feel really luxurious. An original claw foot tub, beautiful fixtures again, and really nice storage underneath the sink. Oh, and you also have radiant heat floors. All right, I'm gonna pause you and then I'll take you up to the final floor. Welcome to the top floor of 192 Washington. Come on up. You're gonna have two winged massive bedrooms and a full bath in between. Let's go this way first. This is the closet that has the stair to the roof, but it's locked for safety and it's also a little extra room for storage. This bedroom is east facing. It's massive. You have, of course, another decorative fireplace. This couple has set up a full home gym here, which is a nice amount of space to really utilize and donate to, and it's not something you have to be packing up every day. Again, the blinds go down, up, and up and down. <clears throat> You've got sliding glass doors here for, yet again, another deep and built out closet. And now we'll take you to the bathroom. And also while we're in here, you have this beautiful skylight here, which rains light throughout the entire home. And then you have another skylight in the bathroom. Here you are in our final bedroom. We're west facing, so it's nice and quiet. The proportions of this room are fantastic. You could easily do a king size bed with multiple pieces of furniture. This is our last fireplace with a beautiful original face. And again, a really deep closet. This room has two closets, and while there's fantastic storage throughout the home, don't forget you're gonna have extra storage in the cellar. And now we'll go into the bathroom. So as you can see here, you have a full shower, great storage, and again, beautiful stonework. There's also actually a skylight in this bathroom that has a remote control blind, so you can open and close it depending on what you're in the mood for. 
This is the final floor that's concluding our tour of 192 Washington Ave. Again, this is a beautifully restored and meticulously renovated home that you can make your forever home. Give us a call to do a tour. Thanks. Bye.